y'all. You back. Just in time. I still haven't fired the grill, but I'm making a spice rub because I'm doing a wet soak on this because we got briquettes going, so I'm not going to waste the potential for flavor. So I'm going to put that on the side, and I'm going to kind of smoke it, slow cook it, and then we're going to finish it later. But if we're going to do that, we need to be putting together a... This is my different different towel for different things. <laughs> Devils thrown in my pride. All right, um, lime juice. Uh, the Cajun smoking seasoning from Winco, good product. Uh, uh, it's basically paprika with a lot of red pepper and the smoky. They really smoke the chipo uh, the peppers in it, and it really has a powerful smokiness. Um, I mean, I used to make smoked salt, and we'd uh, I take liquid salt, and not the kind I buy, a different kind, and then dry it up, or liquid smoke and dry it up with salt, and use that as sm smoked salt on my French fries. People loved it, man. All right, so and then um, so I'm going lime cumin with the um with the cajun smoky and if i'm going to do that what, what, what am i reaching for all right i'm going to do this did it put sugar in there yet oh look my sink's busy no i didn't put sugar in there yet so on in my prime i hit the bag three rounds today and I did like five miles yesterday and went to the disc golf course, and I'm like, you know what I mean? I want in my pride. And I decided to just like, found some kind of second wind in me, so I went for another five mile um, run this afternoon after doing three rounds with a bag. I think you see like two earlier. Well, anyways, you yeah. know. Trying to get in the right groove to get all this done, man. I guess if you guys are going to start listening to me and people are going to start saying a lot of controversial stuff, and we just got to get on this. Uh, what what is that? I'm not using that one. What was that? Are we reaching product breakdown, or did the heat do it? Oh, there we go. Good product. That was more the just crystallized lime. This is straight acid, basically. It's a straight acetic acid, man. Um, not to be trifled with. We put the sugar in. Last thing we're going to do is put a squirt of oil in here, and then we're going downstairs. Um... I'm, a, I'm just going to sit down there and read a book for a while. I'm working on Mandela's book, and since the man's ill, I would be like, I don't know. There's an emotion in reading somebody, something that is about somebody still alive. And then, so, right there. And the other thing we need is salt, which is downstairs. We'll cover that. All right, that's for work. the line back ribs. Which are, since they're gas sealed, they're actually gas sealed and it, it keeps the meat a lot, lot longer. Um, you can submerge them in water and not getting a uh, water um, penetration like you can do with some industrial meats that are, that are sent to you. I can just let, them, let it sit there for a little bit. You might find a little water logging, I don't know. Usually the seal is pretty good, man. Especially uh, that seal looked like it was really done well. All right, we're going to go. I'm, I'm dying to smoke this half cigarette. I've been dying to do it for all half day. No, like two hours or something. Anyways, I got spicy food in my mouth. Sheel. Peace, y'all. Thorn in my pride. Thorn in my pride. If I had it right, my brother would have all his pride set in the right places and there would be no thorns. That would have taken away all my aces. So I won't guide. I won't fight. With the last of my mind. The stone in my pride. Hmm. Feel me? 
That's kind of deep.